Okay, so today we're going to learn to crochet in a row. So you're going to start with a chain 15. Now, this is sped up, I do not crochet that fast. You'll crochet one extra chain to make it 16 because that one will go away when you stitch. And from your hook, you're going to count two chains. You'll see one, two, chain one, chain two. In that second chain from your hook, you're going to insert your hook, yarn over and pull up a loop. You'll yarn over, pull through both loops, and that is a single crochet stitch. Now you wanna do that across your row, working from right to left, and that will give you 15 single crochets toward the end of your row. You wanna count just to make sure you made it, but it should be in every single one of your chains. Now when you get to the end of the row, single crochet. So at the end of your row, you're going to want to chain one, and then you're going to turn your project so you're going to work from right to left again. So you'll insert your hook into that first stitch that you made. It was actually the last stitch on your previous row. You'll insert your hook, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, and pull through two loops for another single crochet stitch. And you'll repeat this all the way across your row. Remembering to count your stitches, you wanna end up with 15. A lot of people will say, oh, I crochet into a triangle. Either your tension is getting too tight or you're skipping stitches. If you skip a stitch, just pull out your work and back up and you can start over again. Now at the end of the row, pay attention to that last stitch. It might be a little bit hard to get. You'll do another single crochet and repeat.